So Tammy didn't want to be videoed in the last one, but she's looking very, very pretty today. I like it when she's got her hair up in a bun. She's eking her head. He's <laughs> being nice for some kind of other reason, I guess. Be nice because I love you, honey. Okay. <laughs> <It's not deep. laughs> Look at the camera smile. Come on, do it. You can do it. Come on, try it, try it, try it. No, do it, do it. I can't. I'm okay. watching. I'm driving. Uh, Mayor Rio says, my puppies are nine days old and they're pooping bright yellow for the last four days. Is that normal? Yep, quite normal. Yep. They're only breastfed by mom and they're getting weight, gaining weight and looking active. Yep, don't worry about it. You know, puppies, they're on goat's milk. Well, they're on mum's milk. Mum's milk, they're going to have runny poop. Just today, we were messing around <laughs> with a puppy and I mean, it pooped all over, and... all over me. Yeah. Bright yellow poop, quite normal. And don't I worry about it. I was holding it yesterday, holding it up. Yep. Dripping on the floor. They're normal puppies. Uh, JB says, I'm trying to research the Euro Hero color you mentioned. I've never heard of it. I'm not sure how to spell it. So could you elaborate a bit? Um, I think Julie, it's, Julie it's, from Canada. Is it U I R I? U I J. Yeah, what did I say? O R. Okay. A R I O. Yes. Euro yes. Hero. Euro, Euro Hero. Um, some people call it almost like gyro. Gyro hero. I mean, I, it's Spanish, isn't it? I mean, it, well, maybe, I know it's Japanese. Japanese. I'm not sure. It's Japanese. It, it translates to white on the underneath. I think it's Japanese. But anyway, what do we know about your hero? Well, I know this. They're rare. We, they're rare. <laughs> they're new. They're new. And they're new, and we like new stuff. And yeah. so we have a litter, and of course. And ours is a fluffy carrier. Yeah, so we, we bred two Euro heroes, and we got two Euro hero puppies for sure, and one that's cream that could be a Euro hero and you can't see it. Yeah. I'm not completely clear as about what it takes to get a Euro hero, and I'm gonna do a, a video on this, so wait for that before I tell you stuff here that's completely wrong. <laughs> oh dear. Dude says, seems like the man can't get a word in without being interrupted, besides the great video. So replies Excuse here. Me? It's usually the other way around. I can't get you to hush. That's funny. Of course, that was a man saying that, wasn't it? Yeah, well, I don't know. I mean, look, here's, here's my take on this. We're both here as part of this deal. You, got, you get one, you get the other. Gotta love us both. Gotta love us both. And we do talk over the top of each other. You know why? It's not scripted. None of this is scripted at all. It's literally just turn the phone on, look at what people are asking, or any of my videos, they're not scripted. So they're not edited, you know, so there is gonna be some talk on top of each other. We've both got useful information to send and we don't always agree on everything. And that's also, you know, we don't edit this stuff because we want to get both opinions for you. So you've just got to live with it. Yep. I love my wife. I yeah, talk you over can her. Tell we're married. Yeah, I talk over her. She talks over me. You know, it's, um, it, it's, it, I hope you keep on watching. I hope it doesn't infuriate you too much. Okay. Uh, <laughs> A-OK -okay says, thanks for the meds information. Babies are beautiful. Thank you. Uh, somebody else says, I'm always, I always bug you when my puppies are having problems. Thank you. Yeah, the, yeah, absolutely. Of course, we want to be out. Uh, somebody else, fish so you're the man. Yeah, I'm going to quit giving you the accolades because it, it makes us look like we're bragging. Okay, so here's one right here. Trent M. Uh, so I think they have a rescue operation by the sound of it. Uh, when their um, dogs come in, whether they're pregnant or not, they get flea treated and tick treated. Uh, we tried either using cap stars, which the vet says is fine for pregnancy or nursing mums. I called Advantix, they say it's okay for pregnant and nursing mums. And what's your what's your opinion on this? Well, um, so what's my take on this? My take on this is that I don't like giving meds to a pregnant dog. That's it. And and yeah, and and the, and the answer is I know that Prevecto is something that is questionable to use on pregnant dogs, although it may say otherwise. So the problem with this always is is you just don't know. So in most cases you don't have an emergency situation and you don't need to give meds. If you have an emergency situation, you can risk it because you don't want to lose your mama. If you have a flea problem or a tick problem, spray, because that's safe. You can do that without having nothing ingested inside the dog. 
a pregnant dog that you spray with free and tick spray, you're not gonna have a problem with it. Yeah. And the only problem you could ever have would be the, the puppies could nurse and they could get it in their mouths. Yeah, so and if you take sure Tammy's advice, which is what, Tammy? Straight down her back. Yeah. Just a little streamline straight right. down her back and then massage yep. it in. So we, we're very conservative about stuff and we just, we just don't want to have a problem. So, and I certainly do not want to give advice that maybe will give you problems, which could be that you use some medication while Dick's pregnant. So there's our take on it. Doesn't mean that we're right. It just means that we're being safe. And so, you know, treat that accordingly. Oh dear. In terms of my dog just had pyrovirus, it sucked. Yes, absolutely. I hope, I hope you survive it. Please get your shots for your dogs like yep. you do for your children, yep, hopefully. Yep, 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 yep. Um, this is grade school. This isn't high school. Somebody's talking about that litter that we had for uh, of that I'm beautiful morals in it. They said they're exceptional way. looking dogs. Thank you very much. They are. That was actually a couple of years ago, so thank you. Somebody else, Twisted Reply, says, why not just mount them? We're talking about doing an AI. Because Frenchies have a hard time doing uh, um, physically getting the job done. And also, you can avoid sexually transmitted diseases. And you've got control of the whole process. So anybody who's in a Frenchie world pretty much is going to understand that. Other people, they may not be doing AIs, and that's fine. Loki feels bad about our dogs. He thinks this is abuse. Okay, there's your opinion. <laughs> Everybody has an opinion. Yep, yep, yep. That's he right or wrong. Right. <laughs> right. Somebody else is commenting on one of our puppies and says his head looks swollen. That's the thing about, by the way, this is the thing about pictures versus videos. So uh, you're going to get tagged right there, aren't you? This is, this is no, the. No, I'm not. Okay, well, I'm doing a video. So we're doing a video of the policeman know. coming by. Uh, this is the thing about pictures, by the way. They say a picture's worth a thousand words. If a, that's true, a video is worth 10,000 words. The thing about videos is, is that it does show truly what's going on with the dog, versus a picture can be taken from different angles and make a dog look like it's long-legged or long-nosed, when in fact it's not, or vice versa. So my recommendation is, is if you're looking at puppies that you're gonna buy, do do a FaceTime, just for the security reason, and also to make sure that you can really see what the dog is about. Uh, color genetics, Moodlock Bulldog says, can this be used for all dogs or just Frenchies? We're talking about the DNA stuff. DNA stuff typically goes through for all dogs, but the DNA is different for some dogs versus others in terms of, uh, in terms of, we're going into the sun now all of a sudden. Uh, in terms of uh, uh, some of these, some of these things are only present in some breeds, not others. So it is a little bit specific. Um, I don't either. When you go on your YouTube, I think somebody's asking if we're going to do YouTube lives. I don't know. We might do that. I'll go check out on that. Sonia Shepard. There are two different kinds of mange. Uh, Demotex, which isn't contagious to dogs and humans. The other one, which is highly contagious, which is scarpotic. Actually, I'm going to read, I'm going to say slightly different than you. I think the sarcopic mange is, it does have a threat, but there is a human version of it that's a hell of a lot more infectious. Uh, but my general, here's the thing, like cats and dogs and things that have ringworm, don't be handling those dogs if you see it, because you could get, in a ringworm definitely is oh, contagious. Oh gosh, yeah. Definitely is contagious. Yes. <laughs> um, which is, by the way, not a worm, by the way. But, no. uh, but anyway, it is, uh, it, it is contagious. So, so look, if you've got any doubts about this, glove up, glove up, and wash your hands after you've finished touching a dog. Call your um, they'll tell you. Let's see, what have we got, time for one more? Uh, Michael Suarez, I'm new to Frenchies. I have two females, a fawn and a black and tri tan. I saw you did a bit of a difficult understanding. Uh, oh, somebody's asking for help. Well, yeah, if you if you want some help, contact us. We'll give you some help. And we are about to go to a school to give some food to somebody. So we are at this point going to say goodbye, Tammy. Bye bye. See ya. Hey, thanks for watching the the video. Uh, I really appreciate people who subscribe to me. It helps me, encourage me to do more of these videos. But do remember, disclaimer here, I am not a vet. I'm not a licensed medical professional. I'm purely a person who's been breeding dogs for the last couple of decades. Any information that you got from this video, use at your own risk. There's nothing implied here. And certainly this should not be used as a substitute for advice from your veterinarian or your medical professional. I hope you enjoyed the video. Come back for more of them. Bye. Thank you.